Maniac! Do you like GTA, Drunk Santa, and Chaos? Well, do I have the game for you. Maniac delivers on your wildest dreams. Play as a drunken Santa, run around a procedurally generated map, and just have fun in all the chaos. Maniac is a sandbox game set in the style of the classic Grand Theft Auto series. Your goal initially is to just survive for 20 minutes and raise as much cash as you can. Sounds simple, right? Well, as you might imagine, the longer you survive and the more chaos you cause, the coppers are going to be after you, and they aren't impressed with your shenanigans. As you hold out against the police, more and more difficult enforcement units will come after you, such as helicopters, SWAT teams, and they're all packing some pretty beefy weaponry. Here is how the developer Transhuman Design describes the game on Steam. Welcome to Maniac, where chaos is just waiting to be unleashed. Maniac is a throwback to the times of the original GTAs of the world in which mayhem reigns supreme. With an arsenal of unlockable characters, weapons, and an ever-changing world, try not to get busted. Yeah, that's a pretty accurate description to be fair. Maniac feels like it was made with love and lets you do the things you want to do, such as hijack a bulldozer and take it for a calm drive through the park. The graphics and controls are all fully customizable and allow you to set all the essentials like screen resolution and vsync along with various settings for things like particles and post processing. Maniac allows you to enable auto aim which doesn't feel like cheating, it just lets you get right into the madness and not have to stop and think and if you really don't want the effort of having to click the mouse button you can even enable auto shoot. Maniac takes me back to a time when game developers just made what they thought would be fun. This game doesn't feel like it was designed by a committee, just by actual gamers that wanted to have a laugh and I think they've hit the mark with this one. The procedural world generation is a great thought and should offer a lot more replayability than just having a static map or two, regardless of how big those maps may be. I can see Maniac as being the type of game you play when you come home from a hard day at school or a boring day at work and you just want to see explosions and carjackings galore. If you're getting tired of waiting for GDA 6 to come out, then this could be a great stopgap for you in the meantime. So, if you're looking for something new to play, Maniac is available now on Steam and is currently on offer until the 11th of April.